Yo, what's up everybody? It's your boy Floss, back again with another video. And today we're gonna take a look at the Dyson on Trek. Now you can pick these up online. I'll throw the link up in the description. The price on these, 500 bucks. All right, so let's go through the specs real quick. Now these are Bluetooth version 5.0 and the codex is SBC, AAC, and LHDC. Now the weight of these is 451 grams, making these extremely heavy. Now you got custom built 40 millimeter drivers. You got active noise cancellation and transparency mode. The battery life on these, listen to this closely. The battery life is 55 hours with active noise cancellation turned on. You heard that correctly, 55 hours with ANC on. Now you got quick charge, 10 minutes of charge will give you two and a half hours worth of playtime. Now you got four mics on each side that's gonna give you crystal clear phone calls. You got touch and physical controls and you got an app that's available for Android and iOS that lets you customize some of the settings. All right, so all that for 500 bucks, let's unbox it and see what it is. First things first, shout out to White Shoes, back in the building. I love my white shoes, I love my white shoes, I love my white shoes. White shoes, I love my white shoes. calm down. All right, 500 bucks, what's missing? Now these are Bluetooth version 5.0. That's a little bit outdated, but that's not the biggest deal in the world. Even though we're already up to Bluetooth 5.4, hey, it is what it is. But there's no spatial audio, okay? There's no multi-point connection. There's no support for APTX or LDAC. And there's no customizable EQ. Now I'm gonna be honest with y'all. I had no intentions of buying these. This is a special request from one of my hardcore subscribers. I'm gonna go into this with an open mind, but I'm not expecting to be blown away. I'm really not. Here we go, <laughs> but let's do it anyway. Dyson on track. Now y'all remember the first Dyson ones? I refuse to review those, okay? Everybody kept asking me to buy those, the ones that had the uh, face mask, you know, the Bane edition. I refuse to buy those because I think they look fucking stupid. But these right here, these are a little bit more toned down, okay? So I can actually get into these. All right, now as far as the presentation, this is the vacuum cleaner company <laughs> coming out with headphones. Hey, you know, again, let's keep an open mind. Okay, now this is already a bad start. <laughs> there it is. Let's see what we get. Okay, so this is gonna pop open just like that. Okay, that's it for that. And this is gonna be your Dyson on tracks. Okay, now let's see. Inside, it shows you some information for the app. We're going to scan that. Let's see. This is going to be your usual books and shit. Now, one of the things that I do like about these headphones, you can change the ear caps and the cushions. Now, these come in a bunch of different colors. You can actually change these. You see you got aluminum. You got ceramic. Okay. And you can also change the colors of your uh, ear cushions, which I think are about 50 bucks a piece. <laughs> a little on the pricey side, it is what it is. Let's see, what else you get in here? Now, this is gonna be your usual books and shit. Full-size novel right there. And this is gonna be the case. Now, the case, hard shell on both sides. Let's see, let's go ahead and slide these out. Okay, now, as far as the case, a little bit better than the uh, Apple bra. <laughs> you know the Apple bra? These actually allow you to charge the headphones while they're in the case. Okay, little Dyson branding, nice and flat. Okay, and the headphones just slide right back in. Now let's see what else you get. This is gonna be, this should be your travel cords. Okay, now look at this. It does come with USB Type-C, the USB Type-C cable, braided, extremely high quality, I like that. Let's see. Little poison for the trolls. Let me go ahead and uh, save that. <laughs> okay. And um, this is going to be your headphones. Now, again, 451 grams. Do not buy these thinking you're getting these. Okay. You see something like the Sony's or the Sennheiser's. These are the super lightweight. Okay. These are the kind of headphones that you can wear all day long with no head fatigue at all because they're so lightweight. These are for more of the premium feel. Now I would compare these to something like the AirPod Max, okay, with a little bit more hefty weight. I think these is like 350 or 360 grams, but still, 450 grams, these are the heaviest. Now, without even putting them on my head, they feel heavy. 
Okay, they feel super heavy. You got these. Okay, these are super soft. Feels like uh, micro microfiber air cups. And check this out. The battery. Now, if you're wondering how you're going to get 55 hours with ANC on, the batteries are here. Instead of in the air cups, the batteries are in the headband. Okay, now the headband, this part of the sides kind of has like an Alcantara feel to it. Like a suede kind of feel. The top is soft. These don't press. Okay, these are just going to rest in your head. Okay, nice stretchage. Let's do the Easter Island head test. Okay, nice amount of stretch. Air cups do swivel. And they're going to lay flat like this. Now, you can take these off to change the colors. Okay, you got six hertz. Okay, to 21 kilohertz. It's a lot of hertz. <laughs> okay. And these just twist right back on. So if you want to change your colors, okay. And you can also, let me just make sure I put that on correctly. I'll play with that in a minute. And you can also change these. Okay, so you can change your ear cups. Now, if you notice, the drivers are facing your ears. You see how they're kind of concave? Into the shape of your ears. Into the direction of your ears, shall I say. Okay. And then these will just twist right back on. All right, so let me get and figure these out. I might have to take it to the book. And um, as a matter of fact, let's grab a phone and set everything up, and then we'll do our usual testing. Talk amongst yourselves. All right, y'all, so we back in. Now, here's how the headphones look in the case. And again, I like this little feature right here that you can actually charge them up without taking them out. Unplug them, and they slide right in and out. Now, as far as the controls, on one side, you have this little joystick. Okay, so that's gonna be skip and reverse tracks. Push it up and down for volume up and down. If you press it and hold it, that'll activate your voice assistant. Okay, on the other side, this is gonna be your power button. That's also your Bluetooth pairing button. You gotta hold that down for about five seconds. And once it's paired up, if you tap it, that'll cycle between your three preset EQs. Now, if you wanna switch between active noise cancellation and transparency mode, you just tap on the side, just like that. Okay, again, you can easily change your different colors and you can change your ear cups. Now, when I put these on my head, I will say this, <laughs> you get an excellent amount of passive noise cancellation. Even without turning the headphones on, these ear cups are so big. Now I got a big head and I got big ears. My ear fits completely on the inside of this, and once you put these on your head, it's gonna automatically get a lot more quiet. Now don't let the 451 grams fool you. It, it sounds super heavy, but it's not as heavy as you would think, okay? They, 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 it doesn't feel like you're putting some giant DJ style headphones on your ears. Like, I could see myself walking around with these all day, but again, if you're looking for something that's super lightweight, you're gonna wanna go with the Bose or the Sonys. These are right up there with the uh, AirPod Max, but even the AirPod Max still feel a little bit lighter, and you can also charge your AirPod Max through the case. All right, so let me uh, power these up. All right, so as usual, the first thing you wanna do is download the app and make sure you update your software. All right, so now let's take a look at the uh, Dyson app. Now, they got a shop tab where you can buy some extra air cushions, a bunch of different colors. As you can see, 50 bucks. Okay, so if you want to change the air cushion color, that's going to be 50 bucks. And if you want to change your outer caps, another 50 bucks. Okay, so you got the aluminium, you got ceramic, you got copper, and you got some other accessories. Now, you have your overview. This is going to be your Bluetooth connection. So these are connected. You got your battery percentage, 90. You got noise cancellation. Okay, there's your double tap to switch between noise cancellation and transparency mode. Okay, you got EQ. Now you only have three preset EQs. So you got enhanced, which will be their signature sound. You got bass boost and you got neutral. No customizable EQ. Okay, you got your sound exposure. This will give you real time sound stats. Okay, you got your headphones behaving uh, unpredictably. Okay, headphones, essentials, uh, essentials, accessories. You got your how-to. Again, there's all your accessories. You got support and discover. So the main features are pretty straightforward. Just noise cancellation and your EQ.
All right, so now let's talk about the look, the fit, and the feel. Now, I just put these on my ears, and I gotta say, I love the way they feel, okay? Super heavyweight, I'm into the heavyweight, okay? Super heavyweight, big, premium feeling. My ears are completely engulfed in the ear cups. As you can see, I'm wearing glasses too. Excellent amount of passive noise cancellation, but the transparency mode, okay? I'm using transparency mode right now. Okay, when you switch now, I can actually switch them from the ear cups. Okay, now it makes a little sound, doom, but I noticed when I tap the side of the ear cups, it doesn't switch in the app. Oh, or does it? Let me see. Yeah, it doesn't switch in the app. Because right now I'm on noise cancellation. Okay, this is uh <laughs> transparency mode. And it's back to noise cancellation. Now, I will say this: the transparency mode sounds great. I got these big giant headphones on and my voice sounds crystal clear. It doesn't have that robotic sound to it. I don't feel like I got to yell. For a set of headphones this big, you would think that <laughs> it's going to make you sound like you're talking too loud. Not at all. So these are right up there with the AirPod Max. But I would say the AirPod Max still have the best transparency mode. But these are right up there, right up there. Now, when you switch to noise cancellation, it makes a little sound like whoom, like it feels like it's sucking the wind out. I can tell that these are gonna have the supreme noise cancellation because I kinda got dizzy just now. <laughs> when I turned on active noise cancellation, got a little bit dizzy. Let's go back to right here. Okay, now for the EQ. EQ, we're gonna start with, uh, matter of fact, let's start off with neutral and then we'll play around with it. Now, there's your sound exposure. If I play some music or some sounds in the background, you hear the external sound and the in-ear sound. Matter of fact, let's try that real quick. All right, so let's try something real quick. Now I got on transparency mode. It shows uh, the external sound and in-ear sound. So let's get that baby crying. Okay, so that's the external sound. Let's turn on noise cancellation. Okay, now, <laughs> now it's showing the external sound and the in-ear sound. Now, <laughs> all right, shut up. All right, now, now, hold up. Now, I got to keep it a buck. Yeah, the noise cancellation on this is going to be serious because even without music, I can dramatically hear the difference. Dramatically. All right, so that's a nice little uh, graph that it shows you. I like that. I like that. But most importantly, how do these sound? Let's find out. All right, for this test, we got a song by Casanova featuring Chris Brown called Coming Home. Now, shout out to my girl for putting me onto this song when we was on vacation. I'm feeling it now. I'm going to start off with noise cancellation turned on, and we got the EQ set to neutral. And we're going to take it over to maximum volume. All right, Birdman hands rubbing together, 500 bucks. I promise you I'm not going to sing. Let's get it on. Now, we're going to hit the little joystick for play and pause. Let's get busy. Okay, now let's go to maximum volume. Okay. Okay, here it goes. <laughs> All right. All right. <laughs> now I gotta say, um, very neutral, very neutral. Let's go over to, uh, okay, this is bass boost. Okay, here. Okay, that's bass boost. All right, matter of fact, let's, let, let's start with enhanced. Okay, here it goes. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. Okay, hold up. Okay, that's bass boost. Okay. And that's neutral. <laughs> <I'll>, uh, <laughs> now, if you've been on my channel for years, you already know what I'm getting ready to say, okay? You didn't hear me singing at all. You didn't hear any, uh, you didn't see any nipples movement. All right, let me just double check. All right, no nipple movement. <sighs> the sound on these, all right, let me, let, right, let, let's see. This could be, maybe, okay, let's see. Maybe it's just the wrong song. Let's try something else. Let's try, um, wow, that was very underwhelming just now. Okay, here's one. Uh, Nas. Okay, let's see. Now, this is maximum volume. I will say I could definitely feel the noise cancellation is incredible, but the sound quality, the sound quality. Okay, here it goes. Now this is a nice bass drop right here. Ah. Okay. <laughs> okay. 
Hold on, let me just check something. <laughs> right now, right now, I got reverse nipple movement, okay? If I hear something that's good, the nipples be like this. Right now, the nipples went like this. I, <laughs> I got reverse nipple movement right now. Wow. These sound mid. Mid at best. Let's. All right, hold up. Let's try a little reggae music, try a different genre, maybe. I, the, the volume is just low. They sound mid. They sound. They sound kind of corny. They sound kind of corny. Wow. Okay, now that's enhanced. This is bass boost. You do hear a little bit of change with the bass boost, but. Hold up. <laughs> wow. Wow. All right. Okay. I got to be totally honest with y'all. The sound quality in these, garbage. Pure garbage. Let me show you something. And that's, and that, you're talking about 500 bucks, bro? I just got these in the mail. Okay, I just got these in the mail. Half the price. Now, I'm not, I'm not going to take them out right now. I'm going to do a separate video on these. But I can almost, I would almost be willing to bet my left testicle that these are going to sound twice as good. Twice as good. Maybe three times as good. Wow. You know, I'm not in the business of buying products and reviewing them and then sending them back to the company. You know, the, the product has to be so garbage, so trash for me to be like, you know what, give me my money back. Like, you know, normally I just keep shit, who cares? Maybe I'll give them away to somebody, whatever it is, but for 500 bucks, uh, let me put them back on the game. For 500 bucks, nah, that, that, would be, that would be the ultimate insult to myself if I keep these. All right, here's another one, let's do Ghetto Story. Now this is, I was rocking this, uh, ghetto story, bro, I don't know if y'all can hear this, alright, they, they have on ear detection, so when you take them off my ears, alright, I put them back on, they started playing again, survival story, alright, okay, here it goes, let me see, okay, I remember those days when you know, that's my home, man. Bro, I can't even get, bro, I can't, I can't even get excited. I can't even get excited. Nah, man, I'm starting to get mad right now. Hold up. Let me put it back on. I'm starting to get mad right now. That's it? Bro. Nah. Nah. Bro. <laughs> oh, yo, these shits is garbage. These shits is pure garbage. Now, all right. I'm not even, I, I'm not even gonna waste your time going, checking all of the, let's see. Um, You see you got volume up and down. You can skip and reverse track. Let me put, let me, let, let me just do that real quick. Let, okay, I put them back on my head. Let's see. All right, yeah, so let's play and pause. Let's see. Yeah, skip and reverse tracks work. I mean, that little joystick is cute. But let me see. Yeah. It's, bro, the volume on these is super low. Super low. I mean, I, what can I compare these to? I would compare these to. I can't even compare these to something like the air funds. Okay, or the sound beats. Even those sound louder and more vibrant. <sighs> Let me try one more thing, because I know somebody's gonna say, oh, you know, these ain't designed for rap music. These are, these are, let's try some jazz music. Let's try a little jazz music. Okay, a little jazz music. All right, let's see how the jazz music sounds. Okay, we got, I mean, eh, eh. Nah, bro, nah. Nah, these sound like shit. These sound like shit. I'm sorry. Who, now, it was one of my subscribers that asked me to review these because the first thing I thought about when, when I hear when I hear Dyson, I think of a fucking vacuum cleaner. Okay, I think of a, a vacuum cleaner when I hear Dyson. I don't think about headphones, and you shouldn't either. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm starting to get mad now because I actually ordered these before I went on vacation. So I left to go on vacation last week, Friday. 
even though I've dropped a couple of videos during the week, I've been on vacation for the last couple of days. I was a little bit disappointed because I wanted these to come. These came to my house on Saturday. I had already left. I wanted them to come on Friday. I was going to take them on my trip. Thank God. Thank God these did not come on Friday. Imagine if I would have took these on my flight and left these home or left some of my other headphones home and took these. I would have been so disappointed. I will say this, though. The noise cancellation, I can already tell the noise cancellation is great. All right, the noise cancellation is great, but the sound quality, the sound quality is fucking garbage. Pure garbage. How would I rank these? All right. All right, let me let me calm down because I'm you know I'll be getting mad when when I drop 500 bucks and I get disappointed like this. Let's go home one more time. Let's do one more thing. Let's try um. All right, we'll do one more song. What, what do we have? The, the, okay, look, there's something that's kind of in the middle. We got Mary J. Mary J. Rick James. I wish y'all could hear this. I mean, it sounds like it sounds like those headphones. Bro, nah. It sounds like those headphones. You ever got on a flight and they give you some free headphones? I right, it's a little cheesy headphones, no name brand on the side. It just says headphone. I, these on the side of these should just say headphone. I mean, nah. Gee, yo, these sound so garbage. All right. Now, I got to do something that I don't normally do real quick. I'm going to take it over to Reddit real quick. I'm going to take it. I'm going to read a couple of reviews because I normally don't re uh, check out anybody's videos until I do mine. I haven't did any research on these. Give me a quick minute. I'm going to take it over to Reddit and see what people are talking about these on, on Reddit. But to my ears, I to my ears, these sound like absolute garbage. I'll be right back. All right, now check this out. I usually don't go on Reddit, okay, for reviews. I like to buy my own shit and review it myself. But as soon as you go to Reddit, look at the first review. Dyson on track. Unfortunately, an off-track disappointment. An off-track disappointment. Now let's see what this dude right here is talking about. Now he wrote a full-size review. Okay, he doesn't like the fact that you have to press the Bluetooth button for five seconds to, to pair it. Okay, cool. The EQ customizations were super limited. And none of the three EQ uh, was quite what he wanted. Let's see. Um, the app is plastic with apps and all that. Okay. Sound quality is just okay. Now, I compared them to the B, uh, the Bowser Wilkins PX, uh, PX7 S2s head-to-head. -head, and the Bowser Wilkins were better without question. Now, look. Matter of fact, let me see. what I, I, I purposely, just, I, I purposely, for 500 bucks, I bought out my Folk Out Bat these. I bought out my, my H95s. I bought out my Bowser and Wilkins. I thought I was getting ready to do some serious head-to-head -head testing. I bought out I bought out the AirPods. Let me show you what else. Because I was getting ready to go crazy. I bought out the AirPod Max. Okay. I bought out one of my favorites when it comes to build quality. I bought out the Master and Dynamics. Okay. I bought out all of these headphones. I, I wouldn't even disrespect these headphones. I'm putting them back in the bag. I wouldn't even disrespect these headphones with a side-by-side -side test. I'm going to do a quick side-by-side -side test. Let me see what I got right here. Look, I'm going to compare these to the Sony Altwares. <laughs> to the Sony Altwares. Let me do a quick test. Sony Altwares versus the OnTrax. All right. <laughs> uh, okay, hold on. Mr. Mikey, we got the thing that we have to look now. Hold up. Yeah, it is. Bro, bro. Bro. You see? Okay, now now I'm feeling a little bit better because I sat down here to make a headphones video. I was planning on getting hyped up, hearing some good music, getting in a good vibe. Bro, the Sony Altwares. <laughs> and, and this is just one random pair of headphones that I pulled out, out of my bag. The Sony Altwares sound 10 times better than these. Now, I'm about to do something that I know I normally don't do. Okay, I normally don't do. I'm gonna rank these right now, but I'm putting these shits back in the box. One thing I will say about Dyson, they give you a nice return policy. Look, you might not wanna take my word for it, okay? Maybe you don't wanna take my word for it. You might wanna buy these yourself and do your own review. Do that. I recommend doing that, but if you know anything about me, you know one thing I know about is headphones. Okay, I know about headphones. I know about quality music. These ain't it. These are not quality music. <sighs> and again, off camera, I read a few other articles from people and people saying these are up there with the AirPod Max. Are you fucking kidding me? 
Somebody compare these to the AirPod Max? No. You might compare these to the AirPod Max in terms of noise cancellation, but for sound quality, the sound quality of these is fucking garbage. Now, I'm not gonna tell you how to spend your money. Do whatever you want. But if you do, <laughs> if you do, if you buy these for 500 bucks, don't come back on this video talking about, oh yeah, Floss, you was right. I'm telling you right now, save your fucking money. Buy something else. I buy something else. I, I wanted to like these because I like the look of them. Um, if they if they would have blew me away, I might have bought some different kind, different color tips. You know, might have bought some different color pads because the pads are super comfortable. Even though with this material, it feels like if you're sweating already, you're gonna be hot. Now I'm down here. It's kind of hot in my basement. I'm already kind of hot wearing these. Nah, bro. These shits is <laughs> R8. Oh, what is it? What, what do I normally say? <laughs> RTS, return to sender. I haven't, I, I haven't used that term so long. I forgot it. I haven't said RTS in a minute. These is 100% RTS, return to sender. I'm a little bit pissed off. I gotta do something. Maybe tomorrow. I got. I don't know. Maybe I'll do this. Maybe I'll do these. Maybe I'll do these tomorrow because I want. I'm, I'm in the mood now to hear some quality music. These right here, I think it's 200 bucks. High res audio. Okay, Bluetooth 5.4. I mean, come on. The only thing that these got going for them is the 55 hour battery life, which is kind of insane, and top tier noise cancellation. But the sound quality is garbage. All right, the sound quality is garbage. Anyway, I, I, I'm mad. I'm mad now. But fuck these headphones. I'm mad now. Anyway, fuck these headphones. Fuck Dyson. Okay, I'm sorry. Let, 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 right, let me let me let me calm down. I, mean, I, I ain't mean to say that. I ain't mean to say that. I ain't mean to say that. Anyway, I'm wrapping this video up. I'm putting these shits back in the box. Let me take a let me take a little photo for the fucking for the fucking um thumbnail. And these these shits is going back. These pure garbage. Don't buy these. I do not buy these. It's your boy Floss. I'm out. Don't buy these shits. Let me say it one more time. Don't buy these. All right, I'm out. All right, let me say one more thing. I I, I hate these so much. I just paused. I, I just paused the video. I was getting ready to do my little outro. I, I'm so mad. I said, let me let, let me see the Dyson return policy because if you buy these, you're gonna need to notice. Here's the return policy. <laughs> okay, so you gotta submit <laughs> submit a form from below. All right, they're gonna get back to you in 48 hours. Make sure you keep the original packing. All right, trust me, you're gonna want that original packing because you're gonna need that that form right here. And we're gonna submit this and get our money back because these is fucking garbage. Shout out to everybody rocking with me on Facebook, Foursquare, Twitter, Google Plus. Shout out to all the Google gangsters. I see y'all holding down that Facebook page. Shout out to everybody hitting me up on Boxer. And a special shout out to everybody rocking with me on Instagram. Y'all know that's where I'm at full time, 100% full throttle. And a special shout out to everybody rocking with the new stream on Sundays. Y'all already know. Stream gangsters on deck. Get your drinks ready. No meat was allowed. Oh yeah. Special shout out to everybody following me on Snapchat. Flossy underscore Carter. That's where I'm at. And a special shout out to the notification squad. I see y'all in the comment section early. Hashtag salute. One more thing, I almost forgot. Fellas, ladies, say it with me. All y'all haters, all y'all trolls, close your eyes and picture me rolling. It's your boy Floss, I'm out. Deuces. Enterprise, Spock here. Spock won the beam up. Jerry Springer here. Uh, subscribe to Flossie Carter for the real reviews. Uh, he has a tech channel on YouTube, and he already has over 2 million subscribers. So uh, give him a look. Uh, you may like it, and it could be very useful. Take care of yourself and each other.